Traffic's backed up this noon after a very bad crash involving six cars and a dump truck sending the semi into the woods. Good afternoon and thanks for being with us on this Friday. First at noon, we're told seven people were hurt in that crash, including three children. It happened at the intersection of Vineland and Conroy Roads around 9.30 this morning, and traffic's still backed up there. Live at the scene, we find Local 6's Calarama. What is the latest, Cala? All right, Bridget, let me show you what the intersection looks like because it has opened up quite a bit, except for the westbound lanes of Vineland Road here. You can see what's going on. Lots of tow trucks here pulling away several damaged cars. There are seven in total. And let me show you the area of those trees there. Just beyond the barrier is where the dump truck is that police believe triggered this chain reaction accident. The dump truck is very large but cannot be seen because it is went, it went over the barrier there and is down in a Bankman. So at last check, three children were brought to the hospital who are in stable condition. Four adults brought to area hospitals in seven cars again, including that dump truck. So let's show you how this all started here. Police say that dump truck was traveling eastbound on Conroy and went through the Vineland Road intersection, slamming into several vehicles before jumping that barrier and then going down the embankment. That driver was brought to the hospital, but we're told he's in stable condition and will be questioned as to what happened at the hospital. Now, police say Six other cars were totaled or have serious damage. We actually just saw some of them being towed away. They are in bad shape. We talked to the girlfriend of the man behind the wheel of a white pickup truck that was hit by that dump truck. Let's listen. Boyfriend was in the accident in the white truck. He was sitting at the traffic light waiting for the light. Tractor trailer came from this end. Nobody heard any brakes locking up. Um, Plowed into that car, ran across the median, plowed into a few more cars, including his truck, ended up in the woods. That's that's all we really know. How's your boyfriend doing? He's okay. A little shaken up, but he's okay. Okay, so what we want to point out now is this intersection here at Vineland Road in Conroy has red light cameras. Police tell me that they will be looking in to if those cameras caught anything because right now they have not determined if the dump truck ran a red light, but they do say he blew through the intersection and hit those cars. So still a lot of questions here, but again, all of those patients, three children, four adults, including the driver of the dump truck, are in stable condition at area hospitals. Bridget? Calorama Live in Orlando, thank you.